In this video, we'll take a look at some of the key new features and improvements introduced in Origin 2017. Origin 2017 contains a number of new features, including several ease of use improvements, new apps, new graphing and analysis capabilities, and greater support for custom programming. One of the most significant changes in Origin 2017 is the Origin Central dialog, which opens upon launching Origin. This new dialog provides examples of graph types and analysis, along with apps, and a list of videos and tutorials to help users get started with Origin. More ready-made plot types have been added in Origin 2017, and the plot menu has been recreated with large icons to help users quickly locate the plot type and plot their graph with a single click. Origin 2017 introduces Excel-like spreadsheet cell notation to be used in defining column formulas. Whenever this notation system is turned on, a small A to Z icon will appear in the upper left-hand corner of a workbook. With this notation, the column short names follow alphabetic orders and are not renameable. Column formulas have been significantly shortened. No longer do users have to write the word column, but the letters associated with each column are similar to algebraic variables and can be written in a similar fashion to Excel or Google Sheet columns. Origin 2017 also introduces new trellis plots, allowing users to easily visualize complex multivariable datasets. Users can easily create multi-paneled line, scatter, and column graphs, as well as multiple combinations of these. Further customization is supported, such as adding, deleting, or modifying horizontal and vertical panel columns, wrapping panels, allowing panels to overlap, adding gaps between panels, and alternating tick labels. 3D bar graphs now contain three main improvements. Now you can plot 3D stacked bars, 100% stacked bars, and further customize these graphs with new bar shapes. In Origin 2017, the annotation dialog has been redesigned to support customizing text, frames, positions, leader lines, and script programming commands in one place. Additionally, users can now hold the Alt key to drag the annotation labels to new data points dynamically, automatically updating the values of the coordinates displayed. Some significant improvements have been made to box plots in Origin 2017, such as showing box plots as statistical bars with errors, means with standard deviation, median, and other statistical metrics. The ability to readily connect mean, median, or other percentile points of boxes, and the ability to plot parallel coordinate graphs, a box plot variant that only shows data points in a vertical line, connecting each data point to another variable of that data. Origin 2017 also provides more fill patterns for column, area, and contour plots, including a large set of standard USGS geologic patterns. In addition, users can also create their own patterns using EMF files. Other improvements in Origin 2017 include multiple reference lines and the ability to initialize alternating shading between them, drop line direction control for 2D and 3D graphs, histograms with labels, more graphic object support in 3D graphs, as well as many others. In Origin 2017, improvements have been made to built-in analysis tools like nonlinear curve fitting, two-way ANOVA, and batch peak analysis. And 2017 also provides the ability to select parameter initialization formulas in the fitting function builder, making it easier for users to create their own fitting functions. Origin 2017 supports the creation of dialogues using HTML and JavaScript, and is able to directly communicate with Mathematica 8 and later versions. It also supports the full National Algorithm Group Mark 25 library which provides over 500 new advanced functions. The Apps Gallery now supports multiple tabs which users can add, remove, arrange, and delete as needed. More apps have been created as well for advanced curve fitting, statistics, and specialized graphing, further extending Origin's advanced capabilities. This has been a brief overview of the new features in Origin 2017. For more information, including a complete list of features, images, and links to tutorials, 
please visit the Origin Lab website at www.originlab.com/2017. Thanks for watching.